The program you are about to see is based on information once thought to endanger the lives of our citizens. The story is real and still classified by the United States government as a matter of national security. Tonight's mission is codenamed Project Jennifer. It must have been a, a horrifying moment for, the, for everybody on that ship when the explosion rattled through the boat and started uh, a descent that, from which there was no recovery. In the spring of 1968, with the threat of global annihilation very real, a Soviet submarine sets out for America. We were doing everything we could at that time to ascertain the other person's capability, the other side's capability. Bristling with ballistic missiles, the K-129 suffers a still unexplained accident which sends it to the bottom of the Pacific with all hands lost. I knew the officers by their names, and so I knew the sailors too. I was at sea with these people. And America embarks on the biggest and most secretive project since the creation of the atomic bomb in World War II would partner the Navy, the CIA, and billionaire industrialist Howard Hughes. He held in his hands so many of the levers of power he had sole control of one of the top 10 defense contractors. Cloaked in total secrecy, Hughes builds a colossal ship with a giant claw that could reach down three miles and pluck the prize submarine from the ocean floor. It was the prize of all time from an intelligence standpoint. The Soviet uh, missiles themselves, uh, they could recover the ship's internal guidance system, throw in the code books and the interesting radio scramblers and uh, the code machines, and you have what makes up probably one of the most remarkable and uh, uh, intriguing packages to an intelligent person. There was a cover story developed to cover any sightings of the ship, and that cover story stood up. But the cover gets blown when burglars steal several secret memos, and Hughes himself slips into madness. Everyone terrified of what's in those stolen Howard Hughes documents. And everybody was afraid that this might really and truly trigger a war. And the top secret contents of the K-129 remain classified to this day. What was captured from the doomed submarine? And what did we learn from the astonishing recovery? They must have looked at each other and thought, you know, I'm 007. I mean, I mean this is a James Bond movie. The most daring spy mission ever undertaken is still shrouded in mystery and remains, as do all the missions in this series, a matter of national security. <laughs>